Hi students. This little video is just to help you with knowing a shortcut when you're posting images to the discussion board. Your upcoming discussion boards this week and the following weeks will require you to upload an image. So let me show you a quick way to get that done. First you click reply, of course, for your post. And to just the portion of entering your image, you wanna use this, what's called an external tool. It has a little blue arrow down, click on that and go down to where it says upload embed image. Click there and this screen will show up. Then you're gonna choose your image from your computer. So this process is uploading it into Canvas. So let's see, we'll just select an image here. And then you have the option to crop the image. You can take any portion of it you'd like, you know, a little corner up here, or you can select all and get the whole image. You have the option to zoom in or zoom out. Keep in mind the size of the text. When you're posting your nutrition labels, it does matter whether you um, have really small print on that label, you might wanna zoom in, use that feature. You can also adjust where um, you, what portion of the picture is showing by altering it to go up or down. So some nice features in there, you can play with that. Um, I'm gonna put this one back to regular, select all, and then you wanna click crop image. If that all looks right, then you upload and embed. This is gonna upload into Canvas and embed it into your post. It comes into your post looking like this. You can select the image and you can adjust the sizing. I do recommend that you do that. Again, keep in mind the text size, but also, Often the image comes in really large and you wanna make sure you size it back down to your reasonable size um, and then type in all of your comments around it. Lastly, you hit post and always watch when it posts if your image actually showed up. If you see a blue square with a broken link, that means that it wasn't uh, put into the discussion board post properly and you need to repost it. I hope that helps you. Uh, but feel free to email me or message me if you're having trouble with that function.